Hi, I'm Elise and I'm going to explain how to install roller blinds. Before you start, you should think about which way you want the blinds to roll. You can have them roll over, towards the room or under so they lie flush against the window. If your blinds have a white backing or you want to go for a neater look, roll your blinds over, towards the room. If you want to block out more light or you have blackout blinds, roll your blinds under, towards the window. To get everything ready so you can hang them quickly, set everything up on a clean surface on the floor in the direction you want the blind to hang, over or under. Once you've measured your windows, you can cut the blinds down to size and install the brackets. To cut the blinds to the right size, first unroll them completely on the floor and remove the end caps from the top and bottom rails. Use a tape measure to mark points down the blind at the width you'd want to cut it to. Mark a few points and join them up so you're left with a straight line. Use sharp scissors or a utility knife to carefully cut the blind down to size. Sharp scissors are safer as they won't slip and they'll make a more precise cut. Slowly trim the head rail and bottom rail with a hacksaw for the best finish, then reattach the end caps to the rails. If you have any raw edges, buff them off with sandpaper. Decide where you're mounting them. Most blind brackets come with multiple screw holes, so you can attach them to your window frame in different places. Use a grey lead pencil to mark a spot for two brackets, one on each side of the window. And make sure they're at the same height and depth on each side of the window frame. If you want, you can use a spirit level to make sure the brackets are in line with each other. Use a drill with an impact driver attachment so they're firmly attached. If screwing directly into plaster or a metal window frame, you may need to use masonry or expanding plugs to screw into. Next, you can install the blind. Mount it to the brackets while it's still rolled up. All you have to do is lift it and snap it in place. Then, it's just a matter of securing the chain or cord to the window frame so it stays in one place. To abide by Australian safety regulations, it's mandatory to install the cord at least 1600 millimetres off the floor. Use a screwdriver to attach a small cord bracket. Don't use stick-on attachments as they're not as strong. Use joiners to fix broken chains without replacing the whole thing, or use them to make your chain longer or shorter. That's it. If you have any questions or want to chat about your blinds, come and visit us in store or head over to spotlightstores.com for more information.